Hello everyone, this is my sim racing rig. So let's start off with the most important thing, my pedals. These are just a standard set of G27 pedals. I took them out of the case, mounted them to this wood piece, and then I went ahead and put the stock brake spring in this clutch, which makes it a lot harder. I put the clutch spring into the gas pedal, which I like. And then for the brake pedal, I actually took a really stiff spring, put it in there, and then put in a rolled up inner tube from a mountain bike and put that in the middle of the spring to make it have a progressive feel. This made it about twice as strong as a Nixon brake mod and that's how I like it. Still feels very progressive. This is a shaker, just a rumble motor from an Xbox controller. I just use it to make the shift gear vibration. Right here I have my foot cam which is a PS3i. It works pretty good for a foot cam. The seat is from a 99 Dodge Grand Caravan. Coming into the rig now, this is my G27. No upgrades, just a standard G27. Right here is my handbrake. And by the way, this handbrake is just a, another G27 pedal that I hooked up to an Arduino. I have a link to that, how, to my, how I made this, down below. Here I have the shifter. Over here I have a M570 trackball mouse, which makes it easier to use the mouse with your gloves on. These monitors are 27 inch, 1080p, 60 hertz. They're not that special. I have to have them very close since they're pretty small. I race with gloves, by the way. Over here is my button box. It's DIY, just the standard stuff. It uses a uh, one of those arcade controllers you can get off Amazon for $12. This keyboard right here is a Z88 keyboard. I'll have a review link down below. Right here is where I control my fan system for cooling me. If I turn it all the way up, it gets pretty loud. But if I turn it all the way down, it's quiet just like this. It cools me off fairly well. This is my blue snowball, which I use for my radio. Up there is my telemetry monitor. My speakers are Loft 40 JBL speakers. They're really good bookshelf speakers. They sound really good. And I have them hooked up over here to a Shure Electronics amplifier. And moving on behind the seat, I have one more shake it motor just to provide the gear changes because it's not really realistic for anything else. I am going to put a bass shaker if I can on the back of the seat and under and behind my pedals. And finally the last thing to mention is my computer. This is nothing really super special. It's just an i7-2600 non overclocked with a GTX 1060, 16 gigabytes of RAM, and a hard drive that holds iRacing. Alright, so that's it for this rig. Of course, I didn't cable manage everything, which is why it looks so messy here. I should probably get that done. But besides that, I have all the pricing for everything linked down below if you're interested. Thanks for watching.